guys, what's up? It's Mallory. I'm going to be doing this question and answer video finally that I promised I would upload like three months ago. Uh, so I guess the first thing I'll do is apologize for it taking so long to make this video. Uh, you guys know that I like to procrastinate. So yeah, but I do apologize for it taking so long, but I'm finally doing it. So it's better than nothing, I suppose. All right. So I have a list of questions that I was asked like three months ago when I first made the vlog announcing my question and answer video. So I've got those that I'm going to answer first. And then I've got a couple of questions that I was asked on Twitter that I'm going to answer too. And those questions were asked within like the last hour. So yeah. All right. So the first question was my, from my friend Jordan. He asked me, are you excited about Black Ops 2? And if so, what are you more excited for? Zombies or multiplayer? Yes, I'm excited for Black Ops 2, but I honestly don't know what I'm more excited for. Uh, mostly because I think that zombies and multiplayer are both really fun when you're playing with the right people. So I guess I'm equally excited for both of them. I'm also really excited for the campaign just because when I get a new Call of Duty game, that's like the first thing I do is play the campaign just because they're really interesting and fun to me. Uh, so yeah. Uh, the next question is from Kalo Boy Swag. He asked me, what is your favorite Nintendo 64 game? Um, the answer to that is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And that's also my favorite game of all time. Uh, mostly because when I was a little kid, I had a huge crush on Link. So yeah, that's why. <laughs> uh, two Girls, One Jimbo asked me, will you ever go to PC gaming? And honestly, probably not. Mostly because I don't have you know, a thousand or more dollars laying around to buy a gaming PC. Um, plus, I already have an Xbox, so I really don't see any point in it. Uh, I did try to play DayZ once with a couple of my friends. Um, I tried to play it on my brother's computer because it's um, supposed to be pretty decent for gaming, but it still ended up being really laggy, even on, like, the worst quality settings you could get the game on. So, yeah, I never tried that again, but yes, probably not going to go to PC gaming. Uh, hi, I'm Nate22 asked me, what gave you inspiration to start doing YouTube? And the answer to that is my cousin Paige, um, because she got into YouTube before I did, and she pretty much encouraged me to start it as well, because it was a really fun thing to do, and it was. I've actually really enjoyed doing YouTube for the past year and a half. And it actually wasn't as difficult as I thought it was going to be before I got started in it. Um, you know, with like the making the videos and, and all that. So, yes, the inspiration was my cousin. Um, we Pro 1234 asked me, are you still a virgin? The answer to this is probably going to shock most of you. Mostly because none of you are probably going to expect it or know this. But yes, I am still a virgin. And no, I'm not saving it for marriage, if you're curious. I just haven't found anyone that I wanted to have sex with yet. And for those of you wondering, I will be 20 in February. So, just throwing that out there. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to move on to the questions from Twitter. Alright, so the first question was, what are your favorite movies? I have to say one of my favorite movies of all time is Saving Private Ryan, just because it's a fucking amazing movie. Um, I love war movies like that, so that's definitely one of my favorites. I also really love the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Um, if you want proof, my first car that I ever got, I named it Frodo. And my second car that I got um, like a month and a half ago, my Volkswagen, I named him Sam. So yes, there's your proof. I also really like the Harry Potter movies. And then one of my favorite movies of all time that I've only seen once for some reason uh, is P.S. I Love You. Um, that's probably one of the saddest movies I've ever seen too. I bawled like a baby throughout the whole thing when I went and saw it in the theaters. Okay, um, I'm Mose asked me, if you could do one thing over again, what would it be? Um, the one thing I'd probably do over again, and it kind of applies to now, is school. I've always done really, really well in school, and my last couple of years of high school, and then even my first two years of college, I've slacked a lot on, and I, my grades definitely show that. I haven't been trying nearly as hard as I had, you know, my first few years of school, 
Um, and I really haven't put much priority on school, which I definitely should, considering it's costing me like thousands of dollars a year. And I have to have college in order to do well. So, yeah. That's what I do over again is try harder in school and just motivate myself to do better. Um, Jazzify, I guess that's how you pronounce that, asked me, what got you into gaming? The answer to that is basically my family. Um, I grew up around gaming pretty much when I was a kid. When I was a little kid, the first system we ever had was a Super Nintendo. So I grew up playing Super Mario and, and Donkey Kong and stuff like that. So, I've been around gaming my entire life, pretty much. Um, Alright, so the next question was from Sin City Spartan, and he asked, Who is your cuddle buddy? Uh, my cuddle buddy is my dog, Gizmo. <laughs> uh, Klutzman16 asked me, What kind of music do you listen to? And I listen to a lot of music, but my favorite, like, genre or grouping, I guess, would be, like, hardcore, like, screamo, kind of... Uh, metalcore kind of bands. Um, some of my favorite bands are Pierce the Veil, Sleeping with Sirens, A Day to Remember. I really like Asking Alexandria, Memphis May Fire. Uh, yeah, bands like that, basically. That's the kind of music that I really, really like to listen to. That's my favorite type. Um, Faze Zimmer asked me, Are you going to be the bridesmaid to mine and Pagery's wedding? And I sure as hell hope so, or better at least be the maid of honor, you know, considering me and Paige are like best friends. Uh, Virtual Stealth asked me, what's your main demographic on your channel? Like gender, country, age, etc. So I'm looking at it right now. 86.8% of my viewers are male. And the top, like the top five countries that my viewers come from are United States, Germany, United Kingdom, Australia, and Canada. So yes, I don't, I don't see it doesn't show ages, but I think it was like thirteen to seventeen was like my main age range when I last looked. Okay, Urban Engage asked me if you could have any superpower, which one would you pick? And he says it can be anything. I suppose if I could pick any superpower that I could have, I'd have the ability to teleport. I guess. Uh, just because I think it would be really cool just to go wherever the hell I wanted to, whenever I wanted to. I would say flying, but I'm not coordinated at all. That's why I never played sports in high school besides the one year that my friend forced me to play volleyball and I sucked at it. Um, so knowing me, I'd probably like fly into a plane and like kill myself. So we'll just go with teleport. Alright, and last but not least... Or I guess I could say save the best for last. My question from my cousin, Paige, is what is your dream career? And I guess that could be kind of two things. I think it'd be really, really cool to be like a video game design and developer or something like that. And I also think it'd be really cool to have um, some kind of job around horses. Whether that was being like a vet or someone who worked in a stable or something like that. Alright guys, I just want to say thank you for watching this video and for submitting questions if you did. I hope you enjoyed the video and my answers. Also, I am looking for someone to make me a new intro since I've had the same one for like a year and a half. So if you know anyone who can make me a new intro or you yourself can make me an intro, uh, add my Skype, which I posted the username right there as you can see, and um, hit me up and we'll discuss thingies. So yes, um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!